point. Don't answer Well, it. we can't avoid him forever. We've got to try. Gerald Bengel? Hi, I'm Lieutenant Disher, San Francisco Police. This is Adrian Monk and Natalie Teeger. Hi. How are you feeling? Like I got dropped out of a three-story window. Now, luckily, I fell on a triple corrugated GE refrigerator box. That's an excellent box. If you got to fall on a box, try and make it a GE triple corrugated. Well, I'll keep that in mind. Monk, questions? Yes, yes, Mr. Vingel, Gerald, do you have any idea approximately when you'll be finished chewing on that piece of meat? Sorry. It's been a long time since I had a real meal. Listen, you guys got to help me get out of here. Oh, it's, it's OK. You're perfectly safe. There's two policemen stationed right outside the door. No, it's not me. I'm worried about Devo. Who's Devo? Mouse. Mouse. Ah, I fell in the box no, and no. Devo fell on me. Yeah, if the doctors find him, I, I don't know what they're going to do. Hospitals hate rodents. They're like fanatics about it. We'll take care of Devo for you, I promise. He's actually kind of cute. Natalie, don't touch him. Later on, if we have time, I'll tell you a little story about the Black Plague. He, he's not an ordinary mouse. He's a genius. He does impressions. Watch. Devo, look at me. Do a gerbil. Be a gerbil. He's shy, but he'll do it. Come on, boy. You can do it. Yeah, go on. You can do it. Do the gerbil. Oh, there it is. Did you see that? Yeah. It's uncanny. <laughs> He's like Robert De Niro. Yeah. <laughs> Mr. Vengel, uh, th those two burn marks on your neck, did he attack you with a stun gun? Uh, yes, sir. And you got a good look at him? Oh, I sure did. Uh, I'll never forget that face if I live to be 40. OK, and you're sure it was the same guy that you saw before in the junkyard? Definitely. The same guy. Mr. Vengel, we think we know who did this. His name's Michael Karpov. I'd like to bring you down to the station house later today. We'll see if you can take a good look at him. We'll set a lineup. <clears throat> Mr. Vengel, how are we feeling today? <clears throat> we finished with this? Mm -hmm. All right, I'm going to take your pulse. folks, but visiting hours are over. He needs his rest. Thank you. Are you OK? Fine. Uh, my shoulder's a little sore. Mr. Bengal, good to see you.